Hey guys, I'm Adventure Andy. I'm playing more Super Paper Mario for the Nintendo Wii, and this game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. So we're about to restore our last pure heart here. This is a pretty epic moment in our quest here. And this is in fact the last one. Not counting the purity heart, which we'll be picking up in the final temple, which is about to be revealed to us right here. On top of the flop side tower. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty much the last time we're gonna see that little animation. I don't know if I'm gonna miss it too much. I mean, I've seen it like six other times. So, the time has come. Uh, I'm sure um, whatever you're talking about, uh, it probably has. Heroes, the last door is at the top of Flop's side tower in the center of town. I'll go ahead and wait there for you. Once you've prepared for the battle that waits beyond that door, come to me. Yeah, but we're pretty much prepared right now. Uh, that damage I've taken, which is about two, uh, HP is very minuscule. Maybe I'll stop by the item store. I have like 999 coins, so I'll have a look back there. Sounds like a good idea. Yeah, wrong way. Oh, crap, I did not mean to hit up. And maybe there's something down here. Oh, uh, nope, just dead end. That stinks. Hmm. What do I do now to make this look like- Ah, oh, there's the first pure heart, and, um, that is what I commend to come up here and show you all. Because it is, of course, very important to me. It has a special place in my heart, if you will. It's not hit up this time, controller. You guys have a very pointy nose. They all have pointy noses, I don't know if I noticed that before, but I noticed it now. Here we go, the item shop. But yeah, shut up, I wasn't talking to you, I wanted to go here. The items are a lot better here, actually. Uh, not so bad at day to you. Yeah, sure thing. Uh, let's get some... Let's see what I want to buy here. I like Thunder Rage. And, uh, let's see, do I have any room for another one? I think I want one of these, too. Oh, no, I don't have enough room. That's fine, I think I probably already have one of those anyway. I pretty much saved this for the final battle, pretty much. Like, since the beginning of the game, ever since I picked up that uh, grape juice, that's what I've been saving it for. And we're gonna head up here now, so we can finally go through that door and um, confront Mr. Black Guy and see why he is wanting death upon us. Even though he's not so sure about it anymore. Which is nice, because villains that show weakness are always very uh, easy to relate to. This is the final door. Eight Pure Hearts versus the Dark Prognosticus. Castle Black awaits. There was something on the last page of Light Prognosticus. Only those who have not abandoned hope can turn back to the prophecy of doom. They walk forward into the future no matter how dark and uncertain it may be. So that's what they look like next to each other. You have fought all this way because you believe the future could be right. You know, well, we are heroes. I mean, you know, what's to be expected? I can't go through this door with you, but I can send you all the hope in my heart. I know that you can do it. I, too, believe in my heart. Thank you, both of you. Leave it to us. And, uh, are we gonna group hug enough pep talk cramps? I'm doing this for me. Tippy. I don't know what in what is in your mind, but if... This is too hard for you. Please, feel free to stay behind. Yeah, seriously, we don't need you. No, I'm going. No, seriously, it's okay. I must I must do this. No, you really mustn't. I mean, it's fine if you don't want to come. Tippy, you've changed. You've grown so strong. So, be sure to return safely to me. Oh, God. I will, Merlin. Let's go. Let's defeat Count Black. I, I doubt you'll do anything of any use. Uh, you can defeat him using my cursor, uh, pointing powers and stuff. And hurry, for the world may not have much time. Oh, really? What what gives you that crazy idea? In that black span, nothing. You will find Count Black Castle. You may find battles harder than any you have ever endured thus far. If you feel ready to face this challenge, then please go forward. Okay, let's go. Mario, Princess Peach, Bowser, Luigi, be strong. You could have said that before I ran into the door. I doubt they heard you. And you too, Tippy. Believe me, she isn't gonna do jack shit. 
After finding every Gerhard, the band of heroes set off for Castle Black. The stakes were high as the ominous void grew larger and the end drew near. Could Mario and friends starve, stave off the inevitable, and overturn the prophecy? What strange twist of fate awaited Tippy and Count Black? These thoughts plagued the minds of our heroes as the, sur as the curtain rose for the final act. I only have to read like three more of those. So this is chapter 8 1. Uh, the impending darkness. Of course, that is to indicate that the darkness is in fact impending. So I, here we are, it's a very nice looking place. So here we are at last Count Black's Castle. See, look, it's, it's all a jolly. It's like the play place at McDonald's. So happy. So friendly. It looks so inviting, too. I mean, just look at it. Don't you just want to run in there? So, Blumier is here. Er, never mind. We better get going. Mm. Not gonna spoil what's going on between her and Blumier just yet. But uh, I think, unless you're incredibly dense, you probably already know how it's gonna happen. Or what's going down. You know. How the shizzle hits the fan, y'all. Uh, I haven't practiced running this stage in a long time, so I'm probably gonna be a little rusty. Ah, uh, so if I can do good enough. Uh, I think we'll be leveling up here one more time. These guys, forget what they are, but they're pretty easy to kill and stuff. I'm wonderful at this game. Uh, let's go in here before that thing kills us. But, yeah, you know, I mean, fun game and stuff. It's too bad we're pretty much gonna, you know, wrap it up right now. Well, not right now, but within the next few parts. Uh, this is really the only time I'll be using Barry, probably. I like to use him on these stairs here. I, I might have used him up until this point in the recording. I don't think I have. I probably did once. Come on, egg. Let's eat that right now. Uh, let's see. In case it doesn't go the way I want it to. Okay, I'm gonna eat my egg. And grab my shroom shake. There we go. That was very, uh... Very tricky maneuver. If you go out there, you won't get anything but experience points, and I don't want to waste my time. So, we're not going out there. Who's going out there? I just want to kill you and stuff. Eh. One of the reasons Barry kind of sucks is because he does the least amount of damage out of everyone. And, like, both in your party and in your just, um, little pixel friends. To kill those things, you flip into 3D. Uh, do we have to kill them? I forget. I might as well kill that one. I'll kill the red one because it's the one that looks different. And, and that's what we do in society. We mock the one that's different. Okay, so I think we need to be Luigi here. Ah, that was, that was the, the, the unfair stuff. Okay, so, uh, hmm, let's just keep moving. I think over here there's a stopwatch and something else. Uh, this is... Is it Ultimate Shroom Shake? This is the stopwatch, and uh, I don't want to get rid of that, actually. Uh, what can I get rid of for this? Uh, let's get rid of the Power Stake. I really only need one of those. And, uh, what could this be? Oh, Alright, Long Lasting Shroom Shake. Uh, I'll get rid of one of these for this. Let's avoid... Let's, uh, I was gonna say, let's avoid that meat. Let's avoid that meat. You know, we need to come over here as well. I don't think we can make this unless we can Peach. Black tube, that's a very ominous looking tube. But we'll go down it anyway. I think I like the artwork of this place one I, uh, better than the rest of them. Uh, I, the only one I like better than this would be um, uh, Ford Francis guys. I forget what his chapter is called. I don't know any of the names of his chapters, I'll just read them when they come up. Die. Thank you for obeying. Uh, let's see, I want this, and this is in fact a key, so we need this. Excuse me, I really have no time to deal with your shit. So, uh, these guys are soccer players, maybe they're Brazilian, I don't know. Brazilian Koopas, don't hit me. I am very good at reacting, but not with my voice. Because when I'm in editing, and I'm like, I say don't hit me like two seconds after something happens, and it's like, well, did I mean to do that? Or, like, what? what's going on there? Do I need to edit differently? What's going on? So I'm trying to make it to the next safe point before I have to call this part a wrap. Uh, hopefully I can do it in times and stuff. I've noticed I can't really enjoy a playthrough if someone's like, Oh, I gotta make sure 
I don't go over the time limit, and I tend to do that myself, though. So I'm going to try to improve myself by doing what I... By not doing what I don't like other people to do, and I'm going to avoid that asshole, too. Come on, there's got to be a save log in here somewhere. Excuse me, I have no time to deal with you, or you. And I could probably go a little faster if I was using carry, actually. And that thing, I don't know what that thing does. And uh, I'm going to switch to Mario now. No point in dealing with a bunch of enemies that I can just bypass. So, uh, yeah, for now, I'm going to mention Andy. And, uh, next time, we will make so much more progress. Because there's always more progress to be made. So, um, yes, goodbye.